And we're back for another episode. In this episode, I'm going to be showing you what I'm doing on a daily basis to level up my alt classes. And as always, hello from Ifri. So pre-Shadowbringers, I'm trying to get all of my classes up to level 70. I've already got my new players uh, crafting and gathering guide that I released ages ago, which I will link in the description. This video is aimed at the battle classes. So what I do on a daily basis is I... Um, use the or take advantage of the duty roulettes so the ones I mainly do are the 50 60 dungeons the leveling the trials I do the 10 guild tests but I'll explain why in a moment and I do the alliance raid um, one on a daily basis as well what I also take advantage of is the challenge log which I will link in the description how to unlock it so with the challenge log each week you can do a certain number of dungeons Guild Hess, I do the 10 Guild Hess as well because this is a good amount of bonus EXP for 10 Guild Hess. They take a minute each to do, so it's worth doing 10 in a week and so on. Give out player accommodations, gives you a good bonus and so on. And as well, with the Fates one, you have to do 10 unique Fates in 5 different zones. All I literally do, I do 2 each in the starter zones. You know, just uh, do them as quickly as possible and I get it done. And it's a good amount of bonus EXP. Um... And then what I also do to level up on a daily basis, I do the Beast Tribes. So right now, this is the Kojin. I've done my um, Tribes quest for the day with the Kojin. And the Anata will also give you good bonus EXP as well. So if we quickly go through this one, you can see here, 286,000 per quest. And I, I said I can do this free on the Kojin, free on the Anata. The Namazu is aimed at crafting and gathering if you want to uh, look at them for that purpose. So, and the amount of VXP scales and goes up depending on your level between 60 and 70. So, effectively, that is what I'm doing. People have been asking me, why have I been doing it to level up all my classes to 70? That's what I'm doing at the moment. And uh, with this method, um, I'm getting um, one or two levels every single day. So um, I am definitely on target to be all 70 before the expansion. One other thing you can take advantage of is the Aetherite earring. If you have pre-ordered Shadowbringers, you'll get this in the in-game mail. Um, it increases your EXP earned by 30% for any class below 70, which is a Disciple of War or Magic, any of your battle classes. Also as well, if you're below level 30, you can do the Novice Network, you can do the first few training quests, and then you get this, a brand new ring. And it will increase the EXP earned by 30% when level 30 or below. And that, that they both of them do stack together. So the, when I, for example, level up Blue Mage, I will be using both. So that's it. That is how I have been leveling up my old classes. That's what I do on a daily and a weekly basis. So if you like that video, then be sure to give it a thumbs up. You can watch a random video over there. You can watch the latest upload down there, or you can click down here to subscribe. Thank you guys. Bye-bye.